Well, greetings and salutations, everybody. Welcome back once again, or for the very first time, to the Fire and Crap Show, where today, as per usual, I'm having trouble moving my keyboard, uh, and it's your host, Andrew, here with part six of Fire Emblem for the Game Boy Advance, uh, running on the Wii U Virtual Console. Hope you guys are all doing well today, ready to rock the next chapter. Uh, hopefully this is a shorter chapter, but we might have to divvy this up into two episodes. But, um, I don't know. We'll see. Uh, oh my goodness, my throat. Oh. I apparently need some water. Oh yeah, there we go, that's the stuff. At long last, Lynn arrives in the land of her... At long last, Lynn arrives in the land of her mother's birth. Lycia is a federation of territories, each one ruled by a powerful marquee. Now, Lynn takes a... Alright. Now, Lynn takes her leave of one of these territories, Arafin, and sets out to meet her grandfather. It was totally not evil, the Marquis of Kaelin. However, the Marquis's brother, Lundgren... Oh... That's her grandfather's brother. Oh, and he's trying to kill her grandfather. Damn. The Marquis's brother, Lundgren, hungers to rule Kaelin. He is preparing a deadly welcome for Lynn, who stands to threaten his grasp for power. Okay. Mm Chapter 6, Blood of Pride. Wow, look at this quaint little place. What city is this? It's a pretty... It kind of looks like the city, like exactly the city where we met. This? This is Arafin. After Ostia, it's the second biggest city in Lycia. The second biggest, hmm? It does seem awfully busy. By the way, where's Kent? Kind of feels weird just talking to you. He said he was going ahead to the castle, but... Ah, here he comes now. Sorry, 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 sorry! Lady Lindis, please let us proceed to the castle. They've prepared supplies for us. The Marquis has agreed to aid us on our journey to Kaelin. He's gonna help us? Yes, that's what I just fucking said. Arafin and Kaelin have enjoyed a sturdy friendship for many years. Once I informed the Marquis of our plight, he agreed to lend us his strength. It's like, hey, hey Lindis, hey Lindis, hey, we're, we're standing like really close. Can, if you want to squeeze my butt, that's totally cool. She's like, ew. Looks like we got a smooth road ahead. Speaking of smooth, I just shaved this morning. Give it a squeeze, come on. If we could pick up some soldiers, maybe some chicks, the road to Kaelin would be that much safer and more interesting. I'm truly sorry for the hardships you've suffered so far. Don't be silly, those weren't your fault. And also, you're so capable, Kent. Kent? Hmm? Oh, and kinda you too, Sane. <laughs> of course I am. The castle awaits. Man, look at all these NPCs. This is terrible, the castle's burning. Everybody go when the castle's burning. What'd you say, what's happening? Smoke from the castle, hey! What are those men doing? 
What do you mean you don't need no water? We'll just let the fucker burn. I have a feeling they're evil. Who are you? You. You're Lindis, aren't you? Yeah. What do you... No questions. Prepare yourself. Hey. That's a... I, I can ask questions. Wrath. Whoa! Motherfucking Wrath! Tell me you're gonna join us. Oh, dude, he, got, he has his own illustration? Assassin. Mm. What? Arrow? Writer? Why do they call him Writer? They just showed us his name. Who are... Oh, dude, he's a badass. Lady Melandis! Lady Landis! Milady Landis! Lady Melandis! <laughs> Lady Melandis Landis! Lady Landis Landis! <laughs> Are you alright? I'm fine. He. This man saved me. May I ask your name? Hmm. Wait! Why. Why'd you help me? I thought a Sekian planeswoman was being attacked. Sekian. I don't know. I was mistaken. No, you're right. I'm from Sakai. I'm Lynn, the daughter of the Lorca chieftain. The Lord. There were survivors? Yes. I just told you. Like, you should leave at once. Blaze has started in the castle and it's spreading. Don't be foolish and waste the life I just saved. You're from the castle? Also, you didn't quite save my life. Like, I had all my fucking crew around me. Anyway, what's happening? How severe is the fire? And is the Marquis safe? And also, I can kick so much ass, you have no fucking clue. The castle's under attack and the Marquis has been accosted. The man who attacked you is probably one of the Marauders. I think they're murdering Marauders. As captain of the castle guard, it is my duty to rescue the Marquis. I see. Alright, then we'll help you. Milady? Why? These brigands are after me. If they're attacking the castle, it's because of me, like, probably. So I must help if I can. Sounds like you're involved somehow. Let's go. Yeah, that's just what I fucking said. You're, you're a terrible listener. You'll accept our aid? I'm Wrath of the Ktola. Our tribes may be different, but I will not abandon a woman of the Sike. Thank you, Wrath. A thousand blessings upon you. I turned it into Sal from Futurama there for a second. And a thousand curses upon our enemy. Come. Well, I, I mean, give me a minute. You? What are you doing in my house? Peace. I mean no danger to you. Your home offers a good view of the battle outside. Look, I'll pay you for the privilege, please. Like a vulture waiting for the spoils, eh? Terrible. Pay up. I'll be hiding below, so don't bother me. Wouldn't dream of it. Now then, which side is the most to offer? Mm, he's probably a thief type. But there's thief. I think thief is a class in this game. I should uh, go see if he wants to join. Once the marquee is safe, my men can move in. Perhaps the secret passageway. Secret passageway? Yeah, it's like a super common thing in like important castles and shit underground tunnel leading to the throne room. There are triggers in the barracks that will open the tunnel. Head through the passage to the throne room and rescue the Marquis. Once that is done, can you drive the enemy from the castle? Hmm. If we can release those triggers, my men and I can handle the rest. There are three triggers, though. All three need to be released, or the entrance won't open. But the doors to the barracks are locked. The enemy's within. If we don't get in pretty good game. If we don't get inside and finish them, we're stuck. So opening those doors is our first objective. The goal of this chapter is to, in case you weren't paying attention, we are going to reiterate this point. The goal of the chapter is to open the doors and reach the three triggers located inside. To open the doors, you need door keys and the services of a thief. Oh. What shall we do, Bean? We don't have any keys with us, or a thief. Perhaps some of the Marauders are carrying keys. There may be times when you are unsure how to proceed. Start by checking status on the map menu. 
visiting homes or villages is also a good way to get information. Who knows what hints you might find. Let's try visiting a house. Please select Lynn. Status on the what? Trigger three switches. That just... That just tells me the goal of this chapter. Really, the objective is the goal of the chapter. Wow. Okay, alright, that's not helpful. Yep, check this house. It has a red roof. Yeah, he's definitely a thief character. Hey you, can I talk to you? Who are you? I'm Matthew, specialist in acquisitions of all kinds. Would you like to buy my services? I have no need for a thief. Oh wait! No, I totally have need for a thief. Really? And how do you plan on opening the barrack doors? Why, how'd you know about... Bullseye! Don't be mad. Hire me. For you, I'll even lower the normal rate. I do need those doors open. Okay, you're hired. Why did you choose to ally yourself with me? Hmm? I was watching the battle from up above. The group looked a lot more fun than the dead guy. Mm, pretty simple, really. You're so odd. Weighing your options like that? I mean, what kind of person, what kind of guy are you even? <laughs> it's time to get to work. Thief Matthew is going to your group. Thieves have picks, which they can use to open doors and chests. Picks are usable by thieves alone. It's time to open that door. Select Matthew. Pardon, you're Bean, right? I'm Matthew. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> door? Door has been opened. With that, you can also see inside the door behind the room. The room behind the door. Within the room, there's a different color floor tile. Tiles that seem different in some way might be triggers that we're looking for. Select Wrath, move them to the tile in order to wait. Triggers can be released by having allied units wait on them. Pressure plates. Yeah, gotcha. Damn, dude has range. Uh, that takes care of the first one. Two more to go. Hit switches. Love it when you hit them switches. Bop, 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 the jewels. Here we, here we go. Like dumb dilly do I keep all five burrows and stitches. All right, man. Let's have Urk take out this bandit. How about that? Actually, what level's Will? Will's three. Urk is level two. Okay. Attack. Iron bow. Bam. Get full. Fire this guy. Down okay when the guys are burning. Wait, that's not accessible. Oh, because there's no door. It's a house. That's apparently not a house. That's a house. That's a house. Damn, that's a village, apparently. I don't know, it looks, kind of just looks like a house to me. Uh, I guess I'll have... Sarah's kind of useless, so I'll have her visit. Oh, so what's your weapon of choice? Swords, lances, spears? Or do you favor bows or magic? Staves? Bingo! <laughs> Whatever it may be, the more you use it, the more skilled you become. Swinging a sword about will allow you to master it. Eventually, you'll be able to wield weapons of greater power. It's as they say, practice makes perfect. You can check your skill level by pressing the R button. I think I'm having a stroke. Alright, Florina. You want to visit this place? Or, actually, wait, she's got longer range. Uh, she can't quite visit the other thing. That's fine. Uh, Lynn's already up there. I'll have her visit that. Visit? Captain of the Marquis Guard is a fellow named Wrath. I've heard tell that he's a nomad from the plains of Sakae. Odd, considering how the Marquis so obviously hates the nomads. I guess the Marquis is pleased to have a nomad under his control. 
The ways of Aristocats are beyond my comprehension. Alright, good for you, man. Uh, yeah, I'll just have her wait there. Uh, yeah, I'll have a visit. We can't do business with all the fighting in town. Mercenaries, right? Can't you do something? Huh? Can't get the barracks open. But a thief with a set of picks could open any door you needed. I may have something here for you. Here it is. This is it. One door key. Door keys can only be used once, but anybody can use them. Yeah, no charge. Get those thugs. Oh, cool. So I'm gonna have to get that to, uh, Matthew, I guess? Yeah, because there's another door. There's another door. I'm betting this one has something good behind it. Or can anybody open doors? He's got a lockpick. I think anybody can use door keys. I think that's the deal. So I can probably have... Same trade with Dorcas here and have him take the door key. And then wait, did they trade? They did trade, okay, cool. And then go over here and probably just attack this dude. Oh, he can't also attack because he already traded, right? Uh, I guess I'll have Kent go over here and attack this dude. Which, what does he have, actually? He has a sword, okay. So lances would be super effective. Plus, I'm kind of blocking his movement over here. So lance, bam. Fuck him up. Get a second, come on, come on, come on. Get him again. Nope. Damn it. That's a bad idea. Saints kind of kill you. Oh, dude, unless he doesn't. That's alright. I want Kent to get the experience anyway. Hey, unless my eyes deceive me, that's a chest. Say, Bean, since we came all this way, why don't we say we help ourselves? Oh, what do you mean, no? Don't be such a bore. If you want to win, you got to use every means at your disposal. That's an ironclad rule. Yeah, I know stealing's bad. I'm well aware of that. We're saving the marquee, right? Let's just call this an advance on a reward. Can use their picks to open chest. Move Matthew into the chest and the chest command will appear. And the contents of the chest will become yours. Let me see if we can find. Go ahead and select Matthew. Is that not already open? It kind of looks like it is based on the picture. What, whatever. Hey, change your mind. Hurrah, treasure time, treasure time. Chest. Angelic robe. Ooh. Hey, this is an angelic robe. That's good for those of us on the less robust side. What? Like me, for example. Magic items like this that increase one's ability vanish after being used. Give them to people who need them most. But don't fret too much about it, or you'll, or you'll never use them. Okay. An angelic robe increases a character's max HP. Okay. Select the item on the item list and use it. To view more detailed information on items, press the R button on the item list. Thief has the skill to open doors and chests, right? That ability can only be utilized if the thief has a set of picks. Number next to an item is the number of times the item can be used before the item breaks. Keep that in mind, right? Why do they call them picks? They just, they're called lock picks. By seven points? Uh, I'll let... What's her name? Use it then. Uh, Florina. Yeah, she could use that for sure. She's kind of a little too squishy right now. Okay, so who has the key? Sane has the key. Can't quite get over there. Um, how much HP does this guy have? Eight. Urk is level two. I'll have Urk take him out. Attack, fire, right. 
There we go. Oh, I didn't have Lynn go to the other house yet, right? Uh, visit? The Marquis of Alphen's hatred for the people of Sake is well known. Nomads are barred entrance to the city in the Marquis' orders. It says you allowed allow Nomad's stench to infect the city long ago. The Marquis was in love with Marquis Kaelin's daughter. So he spurned in favor of Nomadic Prince even so. The Marquis grows in far treatment with Horthen. Okay, that was useless information. Thank you. Uh, I'm gonna have Wrath go here and wait. And... I need Syrah to, like, catch back up. Wait, Dorcas probably to go over... Actually, I'm not sure which way is going to be the right way, but I'm going to send him up here. And we'll... Ah, man, I can't get up there either. Alright, that's fine. Have him wait there, and then Florina... I think I need her to trade. Wait a minute. Yeah, she's an open slot. Okay, cool. Right, I'm gonna have her go over there then, because I need her to trade with uh, uh, fucking Matthew. And this guy. It's a bandit? A different kind of bandit. Axes are good against lances, right? Shit. His stats are garbage, though. I mean, I could just do lance against lance, that'd be neutral. Oh, okay, he's got the... gotcha. Attack, lance, down. Come on, Kent, get it. Get it, yeah! It's my boy! It's my boy! Sane has the key anyway, right? Yep. Door? Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, but one of the switches is there. He's got... pretty much all of his HP. Uh, yeah. There we go. Get him again. Boom. Yatch. Alright. So, I'm gonna need... I mean, Sane's already kinda hurt, so like, yeah. I'll put him here. Wait. Is that door? It's a second trigger, only one more. Yep. Betting Matthew is not good in a fight, so I'm gonna have... Dorcas go up here and wait. Wrath has a range of what? Range of two. Wait, is that the same as a... Uh... Yeah, okay. Sword? Okay, yeah, he does have a sword. So Matthew's kind of a... Uh, kind of squishy. He's kind of weak. So I'll have Syrah up here, catch up with everybody else. Wait. Lynn. Whoops, nope. Here. Wait. Matthew back. Well, Florina can't really deal with that archer, so... I mean, she can't get close enough anyway, so... I 
should I pull the lane back? I don't know. go here and trade give her the angelic robe and then item angelic robe use there we go and wait so now she can actually do some damage all of his HP. Okay. Good, good, good. There we go. Indirect attack. Nice. Got that bandit one shot. Or one turn. Whatever. Alright. Try to get Lin up here. Well, actually... Nobody really needs healing right now. Maybe Kent, I guess. I guess I can have Sane, like, rejoin. So we're gonna go here and staff, heal, Kent. Pop them off a little bit. Alright. So he uses what? He uses a lance. Okay, so axes would be beneficial here. So I'm going to try to get Dorcas a win. Um, so I'm going to have a wrath attack with the bow. By Lenderson or Cadre. When did you arrive? The matter I shall deal with you. Yeah, I remember these fuckers. These uh enemy types. He's a uh, yeah, he's a knight. Alright, that's a problem. Uh Dorcas will have the advantage though. He's the only axe wielder I have anyway, so. Attack, Iron Axe, bam. Uh, that's pretty good, Dorcas. Damn. He might kill Dorcas on the next turn, though. Which would be pretty bad. He's got an Iron Sword. What does this guy have? Damn it. He has an Iron Lance. Alright, that's fine. Uh can't get there in time. Alright. have Florina, like, try to get him. Ah, this might be a bad idea. I'm gonna create a restore point just in case I, like, lose Dorcas here in a minute. Uh, let's go... I mean, it's a Slim Lance, like, she has a chance to, uh... She has a higher crit chance. Uh, come on, get her. Hell, really? Wait, does he have too much... He has too much defense. That's what it is. Alright. Yeah. 
Alright, I'm just gonna let Dorcas finish him because he should be able to just like get him in one. I mean, the hand axe accuracy isn't that much lower. Because it's very possible he'll like counterattack and then kill Dorcas, so I guess I'll just play it safe here. There we go. Lord uh, Lundgren. Lundgren. Whatever. Dorcas is uh, still what, like, yeah, level 3. Luck and skill, that's not bad. It's pretty good. Uh. Wrath is level 7? Holy shit. Yeah, okay, alright. Wait. This is it, the last trigger. If I press this... There it is, be in the hidden passageway. Good work, we'll take... let Wrath take over from here. Oh, wait. Oh, fuck. No, 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 no. Yeah. I thought I'd still be able to do the other shit. I want to get that door open, but I guess that's optional. Wait a minute. So I'm gonna have Florina go for this guy, cause, um... I mean, she wasn't dealing damage anyway. Got no defense? Alright. Florina! Get it! Very good. Oh yeah! Hmm. Yeah, Dorcas, get him! Fuck yeah. Ooh, that is a better level up too, wow. Alright, now I'm glad I reloaded. Yeah, okay. So, Florina, here. Door. Loot. Uh... Wait. I guess, because he's not close enough. And turn. Like, there's nobody left, so, like, who cares, right? Chest. Armor Slayer. Okay. An Armor Slayer. Just as the name suggests, Armor Slayer is useful against knights in armor. Oh, you want to know something? You need to give weapons to those who can wield them. Otherwise, it's just a waste of a perfectly good weapon. Take this blade. I mean, I can use it, but. I'm not too strong, and I just hate being counterattacked. Anyway, think strategically about who you give weapons to. You get a weapon or a staff you can't use. Don't worry, other members of your party might be able to wield them. Items you can't be here great in text. You can only trade items one character at a time. Yep. Like Florina, for example. I don't think she can use swords. No. Uh, Kent would be a good choice, I think. Considering he's got... Oh, he's about to level up in his proficiency, too. Yeah. I mean, Lynn would be good here, obviously. She's like, you know, kind of the best character. Um, but I don't want characters like Kent to fall behind. He can't quite get there. She definitely can't get there. I mean, I think Cavaliers have better evasion, typically. It's aid. We rescue, right. Uh, is it... Is 
move? Speed? Evasion and attacks. Okay. Yeah, he's got a speed of 9. Lin has a speed of 12. Okay. So I guess Lin would probably be a better person to use that for, so I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna, like... Definitely get that from Matthew, because I... Don't imagine he'd be sticking around. Like he might, I guess, but hmm. Uh, you know what? Slight armor slight. There we go. I'm gonna have him trade swords too, because like he has a perfectly new like iron sword. And like I'm not gonna be using him for attacking anyway. I think that's everybody. Right? Oh, Dorcas is hurt. Right. Uh, Sarah, you want to heal Dorcas there? Staff, heal Dorcas. Although, I think in between chapters or phases or something, I think. I haven't figured that out yet if, if uh, units are healed in between. We'll see. Sane's hurt. I'm not going to heal him. Uh, wait. There we go, this is it, last trigger, if I press this, bam. Is it being the hidden passageway? Good work, let Wrath take it from here. Yeah, I gotta get going, because we gotta eat food, we gotta eat dinner. Ah, uh, it's Wrath. You've done well with a performance. Sir, if you have praise, it should be given to this group. Hmm, who are you? My name is Lindis, I'm pleased you're well. Oh, it's you. You're the Marquis Caitlin's. Marquis Caitlin's? Okay. Leave us, Wrath. I would speak to this girl. Now, Lady Lindis, do you know the identity of those responsible for this uproar? I believe it to be the work of my granduncle, Lundgren. That's exactly right. Granduncle. <laughs> Which means my castle has been damaged in your family's petty inheritance dispute. My apologies. When I, when I heard that Lady Madeline's daughter was in trouble, I thought to lend my assistance. I find I've changed my mind. I withdraw my offer. Unless you want to pay for repairs. Marquis Arafin, you gave me your word, my lord. Your name is Kent, is it not? You failed to inform me of one most vital detail. That my fucking castle was on fire. What, what do you mean? Er, uh, sorry, that was the wrong voice. This girl does resemble Lady Madeline, but... I didn't expect to see her so tainted with the blood of Sakae. What? Don't you feel the Marquis of Kaling would be troubled to meet this nomadic mongrel? You! Sane, hold. My apologies, my Lord Marquis. Hmm. Your man is poorly disciplined. Marquis Arafin. Please, if you would grace us with your aid. I hear Maki Kalin is ill in a bed. I question whether he will survive to meet this girl. In which case, his brother, Lundgren, will claim his title. And I certainly wish to avoid trouble with the coming Marquis. You scheming. Sane. I understand. Kent, Sane, we take our leave at once. Lady Lindis, we... I'm proud of Sakae blood that runs through my veins, and also, like, we don't need this guy. Fuck him. <laughs> I will not accept aid from one who disgraces my heritage. Oh, yeah. Get it. That was well done, m'lady. Marquis is allowed. Don't worry about anything. We'll, we're all here for you. Isn't that so, Kent? I beg your forgiveness. Are you apologizing, Kent? I've been so concerned with seeing you to Kaelin. I failed to take your feelings into account. Is that it? <laughs> Trouble yourself no more. I'm like a total tomboy and shit. You've put my safety above all else. I've seen that... Hold your head up and be proud. Oh, I have seen that. Okay. I don't know why they did it ellipsis. That's weird. Lady Lindis. Maybe 
there was a long pause, I guess? Uh, bah, arrogant child. If she had but shed a single tear, would have granted her request. We lit... Lys Lysian nobles will never understand those pit prideful savages. Damn. Are those your true feeling? Oh. Are those your true feelings towards the nomads of Sakae, my lord? What? Oh, Wrath, I didn't see you there. My comments do not reflect on you. You are my captain. I'm proud of your service. Of course. As long as we bend our knee to you, you care not who, where we're from. But when an equal comes from my lands, what conceit? Wrath, how can you speak to me like that? I have treated you well, have I not? I have paid you well, I have treated you better than your kind deserves. You will never understand. My service ends here. That's what you get for looking down on people, man. Marquis of Arifin, he said my grandfather was ill. I must hurry to Kaelin. As we approach Kaelin, Lundgren's obstacles will be more difficult to overcome. However, I vowed to see you through to the end, lady. I'm counting on you, Kent. I'm with you, too. Thank you, Sane. Bean, thank you for always standing at my side. It's because of you that I... I will persevere. They'll never break my spirit. Dope. Da da da. Wrath. What is it? What do you... I overheard the Marquis talking to himself. Lynn of Lorca, proud daughter of Sike. I would join you. I would add my strength to yours. Really? And this... I want you to take this. This is gold? It's too much. Can't accept it. Well, we haven't made any cash in, like any of these chapters, except for that one person that gave us some kind of... Anyway, I have no need for it, and if it'll help you. But I cannot take back something once offered. Wrath, I thank you. Five grand? Fuck yeah, dude. Now we just need some shops. All right. What's it going to do for today, guys? Uh, we, in fact, did get through the chapter. That was unexpected, but um, very cool. But uh, thank you all for being here. Greatly appreciate it. And, uh, of course, before we get going, a very special thank you going out to... Actually, you know, I'm just going to create it right here. Why not? Let's do that. Um, yeah, very special thank you going out to the current Farts and Crap Show members, which at the time of recording is just Novalis Recordis. <laughs> Novalis Recordis. <laughs> Novalis Draconis. But if you want to be incredibly awesome and support the show a bit more directly... And get in on all those membership bonuses like Navalis Draconis. Check out the join button down below. Tier start at three bucks a month. It's only ten cents a day. Gets you into all the stuff. Uh, pretty much. And uh, until next time, everybody. Take care and have yourselves a good one.